matchup. Las Vegas! No, you're not in Vegas. Um, thank you guys very much. Um, you know, yeah, we're wearing matching jackets. Get used to that. We are super weird. You guys are coming up a couple of wins. Yeah, we won I heard three, three, three. What are they? Fans' choice. Um, we won Song of the Year. Yeah, and Break and we won So Can. We've written a lot of songs, uh, but we work really hard on our songs. You know, we don't take it lightly. Um, it's catchy because we work hard on it. Yeah, our Canadian fans are, are of our favorite fans. They're just so energetic. You know, when we, we've been on tour at Maroon 5, every show, the response was a feeling of home, a feeling of love, and uh, an appreciation for our music, and it just feels real, you know, we love it. Yeah, you guys are really close to your fans, eh? Yeah, yeah they all live with us. Um, most of our fans live in uh, my basement. Um, <laughs> no, that's it's crazy, I like it. bringing uh, reggae and ska back into the mainstream light. It feels cool. We we always like to when people say that we're kind of like the fresh thing that's happening. That makes us feel, you know, validated and but we don't really consider ourselves just reggae. We feel like we've got a whole bunch of different genres going on in our sound. So but well, I mean, hell, we'll take any compliment we can get. Do you like reggae music? For trying to be the one who can have it all. Do you guys have any plans uh, when you guys aren't touring? There's a few days off, but we really have no control of that yet. We have no idea what's going to happen. Okay. And a lot of the times, especially with Europe, because a lot of the drives are really far from one um, country to the next country, um, you basically are on the bus sleeping. But if I know one thing, because we're soccer fans, there's a big uh, Champions League final, yeah. and we think we have a day off that day. So oh, we do? Yeah. Where is it? Uh, I'll make a call. I have nobody <laughs> to call. call us people. Yeah. I have nobody to call. Hey, right, um, Marquee? Yeah, you know, it's like, like, you know, they're beautiful places. We've been to a few of them, but we definitely hope to, to, to see some. We've, I've never been to Italy. Yeah, yeah we're never been to And Mark's Italian. Italian. Say something doing? in Italian. Uh, sono Marco, uh, suono la guitarra. Beautiful. Oh, Mark, I play the guitar. No bueno, bueno. No bueno, bueno. No bueno, bueno. Any funny band moments with you guys? So we're on the tour bus, and uh, there's this game called Mortal Kombat versus, uh, what is it? DC. DC. Oh, yeah. DC Heroes? Yeah, yeah. so yeah. basically, it starts off where Alex and I are more of the gamers, right? Yeah. And so we're playing. And these guys are like, why are you always playing video games? They touch the game, and then it got to the point where we, I always look at him, I'm like, challenge? Now Mark would look at me at 2 a.m. and be like, I'd be like this, I'm like, challenge? <laughs> it became a routine, like a like challenge? And it became the whole band and a bit of the crew at like 4 a.m., 2 a.m., playing battling. this game, like grown men. Our new single, like No Way No, that, yeah. you know, like everybody's playing it out here, which is great. I thought it would just attract the ladies, but a lot of like, male fans like man really I love that it. jam yeah, really you know so luckily for us we are getting both you know we're getting the girls and we're getting the guys and when you go to our shows you see the balance of everything and you know tonight we're playing uh, we're playing a show tonight the, the chum fest fan fest and we're gonna kick some butt Who's the lady's favorite here? Marky P. I don't feel like I'm released. These guys are all beautiful, Maybe handsome men. One, two, three. Canadian Music Week rocks.